Hello everyone, Ray Waldo here, the Bishop of Technology. Check our website, raywaldo.com, for all questions and comments. Please uh, leave comments on my website rather than YouTube. Uh, yesterday, we, uh, the last episode, we installed the uh, Team DRH uh, Jelly Bean on the ViewSonic G Tablet. This is the G Tablet, and I also have the uh, uh, Motorola KZ450 uh, Bluetooth keyboard connected to it as well as Motorola Bluetooth uh, uh, mouse. So we have full mouse capability and we have the keyboard capability. This is actually the YouTube uh, application running the, uh, the program YouTube and this is actually the video of what we installed yesterday. So we're going to stop that just to show you that YouTube works. Uh, and uh, we'll go back here and uh, close it. Hello, there we go. And uh, go ahead and close out all this. And uh, this is Google Now. And uh, Google Now is the extended search Siri kind of stuff that uh, Google does and it does work here and the mouse the uh, mic works my understanding is the mic will cut out after a few seconds so but you have t time to enter a few things like navigate to Hammond Louisiana and of course we installed the uh, Google Maps it's still listening okay. uh, navigate. navigating and there it's navigating, and uh, of course it doesn't know exactly where I am, but it actually does go into navigation, and because uh, the GTAB doesn't have the uh, the GPS, so it's going to give me a little error. But you see how it works there. Okay, so uh, we'll go ahead and accept whatever, and see what happens. Yeah, it wants, it wants the GPS, and I can't give it GPS because I don't have a GPS. But uh, you see how it works. It does uh, go into navigation, and uh, we can use the mouse. You see it using the mouse here, and so we'll just exit. Uh, and uh, you can install all the... Uh, it will automatically install the Amazon... Uh, app Store application for you when you install the Team DRH version of uh, Jelly Bean. It, uh, it will install quite a few applications for you and so far just about everything that I've tried has really worked. Uh, of course up here in the uh, right hand corners where you get your applications and uh, the only thing in this list that does not work that I remember is the Ice Age uh, little game. It does not work. Uh, let's see if there was anything else that I noticed that did not work. Uh, most everything seemed to work fine. Uh, the XDA uh, professional uh, tablet version works. Time magazine works. I didn't try all of them, but uh, it seems to work quite well. I, I'm, I'm very satisfied. It's, it does have a little bit of slowdowns every once in a while. Uh, I noticed the mouse might stall just a little bit once in a while, but mostly it's running pretty good. And of course you can uh, use the mouse to drag and drop and uh, uh, the mouse works pretty good. If we want to do Google, uh, we can click on Google and we can type in uh, this, well, whatever. Uh, but uh, you see the, the keyboard works. Uh, it's, it's really a pretty nice setup. Um, it's not perfect, but my, uh, you, know, you you can get a a near laptop experience out of this, and uh, of course with Android it's not quite the same, but uh, it's it's pretty good. So overall, uh, I kind of like the the uh, the new Jelly Bean. It does have uh, it seems to work a little bit quicker, and it works a little bit better than the. Uh, the previous version versions of ICS. Uh, it doesn't have quite as many stalls uh, so far. Uh, it seems to run pretty good. The battery, uh, I've had it on since last night, uh, about uh, 
all probably, let's see, that's 12, uh, 12 hours, I guess, uh, something like that, uh, since, well, it was midnight, would be one this morning, about 12, uh, it was 10 o'clock, I guess, when I did it last night. So uh, 14 hours it's been on, but it was, uh, for most of the night, it was into in the sleep. And uh, so we still have a reasonable amount of battery. It looks like about half the battery down here. And uh, I've used it a reasonable amount, probably a, an hour or so this morning uh, and today, in trying to set it up and run it, maybe a couple hours. So it's got, uh, it's not the best on battery, but it's doing pretty well on battery. Okay, so that's a quick look at uh, Jelly Bean on the uh, G tablet from ViewSonic. See you next time, and again, if you have questions, be sure to leave them on my website. Uh, comments on uh, YouTube are very difficult to work, and I don't always check YouTube, so if you want a quick answer, go to raywaldo.com, enter your comments there, and I'll see it almost immediately. All right, see you next time. Bye.